Hey guys, it's Phase One once again with another video. Today we've gotten some new information pertaining to the new RSI Heavy Miner, and it's called the RSI Aristra, and um, it's a uh, quite an intriguing ship. And uh, just to let you guys know, um, if you don't want to see or hear any spoilers, just click away from this video because this is going to be a spoiler if you don't want to see it. This is intended to come out um, through the Hollow viewer in this coming IAE, so you'll be able to see it during the RSI day. But if you want to see it early, and um, you can you can see it here. A big shout out to the um, the Pipeline Discord channel as well as the individuals that worked out the uh, 3D model, and it's by Zyka. It says Zyka um that uh did this 3d model for us to at least get some um uh, get a look at it before the ie event all right so um make sure to leave a like and subscribe as we go through this video all right so um before we get into it this is meant to be a heavy miner all right so this is going to sit between the um the mole and the actual um orion all right so um, CIG is going to build this before the Orion because they need to test out the concept of mining and refining at the same time. You're going to find out some really interesting details about this ship. Okay, so here's the description that they found through the leaks here. It says, with all the risk involved in mining the universe, vast stores of valuable resources, RSI wants to make sure that choosing the right ship, it's one of them. The Aristra industrial mining platform was concepted from the strut up with safety and efficiency in mind. The remote operator seat provides extra protection to your crew. The onboard refinery is ideal for more profitable workflow. The automated mineral storage pipeline effortlessly prepares your gathering resources for transfer. An auxiliary garage allows for increased operational flexibility while on site so this this ship is going to be awesome so um here's a quick look at it um so why while i uh spin around this thing it's really interesting because everything that we've all the issues that we have um pertaining to mining and the upcoming refining gameplay they put everything they fix essentially they're essentially going to fix everything um in this ship here right so instead of uh the risk of your remote being out there physically inside of a turret you'll be controlling remote turret remote mining turrets so that's the, there's a safety there right so your your operators are actually going to be inside of the ship similar to the reclaimer where they operate actual remote turrets so that's a good thing um in terms of also refining you'll be able to refine with this thing on site as well so you don't need a separate ship to help refine you know so that's going to allow for more um flexibility in terms of um you know um the the, the uh ships that you'll need to bring out in order to fulfill in a, a mining operation depending on how much people you have right so if you have less people and uh, you just have quite a few guys you can just get everybody on this one ship and essentially do everything you need fill out your cargo hold with all refined ore and then you're out you know so this is this is going to be fantastic so now the the look of the ship is very rsi but also very industrial as well i'm loving the new rsi look with uh um, these thrusters it's it's gorgeous man it's gorgeous it looks kind of similar to the upcoming galaxy build the galaxy platform itself and it's looking awesome i love the industrial look of this thing it's cig is really knocking it out of the park and if you look at it it looks like these could be even cargo pods that can maybe um eject maybe or these could also be where um yeah these could be cargo pods as well as these that can be ejected similar to the orion orion has pods that can be uh attached and detached so it seems like that's what these are going to be for yeah 
yeah that's what it looks like so i wonder why these are here so maybe these have a different purpose in terms of how things will operate maybe these are going to be for storage um for the refineries and these when they're complete they'll pop out of here maybe for haulers to come and pick up maybe not sure um but um looking at the size of the ship the fact that it's going to sit between the mole itself and the orion it seems like if you were to ask me it's going to be around the size of the reclaimer itself so you're looking at a massive ship that can hold quite a few people and this this is going to be a very useful industrial ship for sure for sure for sure for sure for sure, for sure. It's, it's a it's a beautiful ship man it's a beautiful ship so now those are the details that i have on it so far um if you haven't already make sure to leave a like and subscribe just to let y'all know my organization phase one industries is now recruiting new and veteran players so so if you're looking for a new org you can check out our discord in the description down below make sure to leave a like subscribe catch you guys on the next video